let's go. Yeah, yeah, you had me out here at the break of dawn, waiting for you for like 10 minutes. Now you're in a hurry, right? So then I say, when it's lunchtime, I clock out and I go to lunch. I don't care. And he just looked at me like I spit on him or something. I don't know, what are you gonna do, right? Yeah, uh, I guess. What's the deal, Mikey? Nothing. No, seriously. Like, you're all cryptic over text, and then I wait outside for you for like 25 minutes. And now you're being like, just weird. <laughs> weird? Yeah, you're not exactly contributing to the conversation here. You're being even more quiet than normal. What do you want me to say, Patty? A question. Friends ask questions. How's your family? Or you could start with what we're doing or where we're going, something like that, right? My God, you see how annoying you are, right? Look, I asked you because I trusted you more than anyone else. Not gonna get that? Well, this seems serious, you being all spooky and stuff. I need you to be in the dark for this one. I need you to have my back. Or you can just get out. So, I've been playing along, right? But I gotta ask, this thing we're doing, it's illegal, right? Yeah, it's gonna be. So, how's Sarah? Really? You're gonna bring her up right now? I mean, we can't talk about whatever it is we are doing, right? So, why don't you tell me, man? What's on your list of approved topics? Good talk. It feels like I'm trying to hold on to her and she's, she's already let go and I don't know what to do. Mikey. You're a good guy. I'm sure whatever you're trying to do is the right thing, man. Put these on. Could you grab these gloves in a smaller size? This is the spot. Finally. You want to go have to eat after this? Mikey!
Oh my God, Michael, where have you been?